Equator Network org has collected all the reporting guidelines for research specific to the study design and it can be easily downloadable and these reporting guidelines are based on the study designs now here is a decision tree based on this we can select the specific guidelines which we are supposed to use if we are handling the research on animals in the lab then we need to use this arrive guidelines if our research is on synthesis of qualitative research then we need to use this enter guidelines if our research is on a clinical case or case series then we need to use this care guidelines and if it is directly on a qualitative research we have to use this SRQR guidelines or CORAC guidelines if we are doing an analysis or review of previous studies that is a systematic review then we need to use this most guidelines when we are reviewing the cohort case control or cross-sectional studies if we are reviewing RCTs then we need to use this PRISMA guidelines for systematic review both these guidelines are used for systematic reviews if we are doing a randomized control trial with two or more health interventions then we need to use this consort guidelines if we are doing observational studies such as case control study cohort study or cross-sectional study then we need to use this probe guidelines then if we are doing diagnostic or prognostic studies then we need to use either tripod remark or start guidelines based on the situation if we are looking at the accuracy of a new or alternative diagnostic test against an established to one then we need to use this start guidelines if we are looking at the prognostic value of the biomarkers then we need to use this remark guidelines if we are looking at the general prediction model for a diagnosis and prognosis then we need to use this tripod guidelines all these three tripod remark and start guidelines can be used for diagnostic or prognostic studies depending upon the situation there are certain guidelines which has been missed out in this decision tree they are for clinical practice guidelines we use agree guidelines or right guidelines then for quality improvement studies we use square guidelines SQUIRE guidelines then for economic evaluations we use cheers for study protocols we use spirit guidelines or prisma p guidelines so these are the guidelines which are missed in this algorithm clinical practice guidelines quality improvement studies economic evaluations and study protocols